Hello and welcome back to the channel. So today is the um, first day of the July um, release for Scrap Diva Designs. Um, and so I want to show you the dies. I did kind of a sneak peek um, on um, Instagram about a week or so ago, but I um, want to kind of go over them with you again and tell you a little bit about them and then um, show you a couple things that I've made so far. So anyway, a lot of cute, cute, cute things. So first up is this, which is the Flip Flop Mini Album. Isn't this cute? Very, very cute. So I love it. So you got the flip flops. You can make the mini album out of it. You got, I have kind of have this layered over the top. So here's your, here's your flip flops, okay? And you have the different layering pieces. You can make shakers. Um, and then these are the other pieces to go. So here's the, you know, the strap that goes between the toe and some flowers to go on top. And then you also get a smaller set of flip flops and the pieces that go with that also. So really fun. <clears throat> so there's that. And then there is the beach ball mini album. Really cute. So it has all these cute little pieces. Um, there's the three different um, layering pieces. Um, and so you can layer up different ways. You can make you can make shakers and, and all that out of it too. It comes with this cute little um, umbrella and this layered up um, surfboard and then these cute little um, swimsuits and this tiniest little bow right there. It is so cute. I love it. <laughs> I've used it on quite a few things already. Really cute. So that's those two. Then there's the jellyfish. These make really cute embellishments. So you've got two different sizes, smaller and a larger, okay? And then a bunch of different layering pieces. This pe These pieces right here, these are like little um, eyelashes <laughs> and eyes. That's so cute. So there's that one. And then there's also this one, which is called the um, soda, soda bottle shaker. Really fun. So it's got your different three different layering pieces. This is a like a label for your for your um, drink. There's the lid you can layer up, and it cut, says the word soda and cheers. And you got the shadow piece back there also. So there's that one. And then there is the this is the mini heart shaker sunglasses. So all these different pieces that you can obviously make shakers with. And there's two different sizes: the larger one, the smaller one. Really cute. Okay, and then this, these three right here, this is part, uh, this is called the zigzag pinwheel. Really fun. You also have layering pieces on all three sides. This is three different sizes, okay? So really cute. And then we have the summer words number two. So you get the regular word and the layering pieces. So you have, um, let's see, I try to remember. Uh, you have picnic fishing, surfing, ice cream, cocktails, sunshine, I think. Yeah, so really cute. So there's all those. And then this cute jelly, uh, jelly tote, super cute. So this is the, that kind of got upside, but this is the, um, the back piece right here. So you got, this is your, there's your, actually your side pieces. So you're going to cut two of these. You're going to cut two of these. This is the side piece. It goes over here. Okay. This is the um, bottom piece. And then the layering piece for the bottom. And then you get this little piece right here that's, you know, for, um, you can make a tag for the front. So I didn't use that piece. I did something different, but anyway, so that. It is what I received in my design team package. So let me show you real quick what I have made so far. You guys are gonna wanna get this stuff for your <laughs> for your summer crafting. Okay, first up, I shared a picture of this early on. So these are the flip, this is a flip flop mini album. So I layered mine all, you know, up on foam and, and different, and, uh, you know, different layers and stuff. And I just did a kind of little grouping right here of decoration and I made mine a card. So mine is the flip flop shaped card. So you open it up. I lined it with the pieces and then 
I took, actually the piece right here that I used was the bottom. This is the bottom piece from the basket. <laughs> That's what I used for my, um, you know, my um, blank space in here to, to um, you know, stamp and, and give my pl a place for writing a sentiment and, you know, writing, you know, for who it's from and stuff like that. So I used a stamp set from um, Simon Says Stamp that I had in my stash from a long time ago. So I just stamped it in a blue to match. And then there's the back. And yeah. So I think that turned out super cute. So I love that. Okay, and then I made um, just a real quick one, uh, a soda, the soda bottle shaker. Okay, and I, I did make it a shaker. So I just have it all layered up on foam, tied some twine around here, a couple different colors, layered up the bottle cap. My background is um, a watermelon, so it's like a watermelon soda. And here's the word. I didn't pop the word up on this one, um, but you definitely can, and I, I, I should have, but I didn't on this one, but I'm sure I will on my next one. So use this is, I use a lot of the, the paper, the holographic um, uh, foil type paper from um, Sizzix. That's these pretty colors that you're seeing here. So really cute. So that's my soda bottle shaker that I've made. Okay, and then here is the beach ball. So um, I didn't make it a shaker, but I I layered it up on foam so you can see down in here. So I, I have uh, just a plain white for my back for sturdiness, and then I have a pattern paper on top, just, you know, a, the circle, and then I cut out the piece that cut out the, um, you know, this pattern here with the striped paper. So I layered that up on foam. And then I used some um, chipboard and stuff from the, um, I'm using Sunny Days, um, if you didn't notice, but um, from Maggie Home. So I used a piece of the chipboard, some tickets that I recently got, um, a cute little rosette, uh, the zigzag pinwheel, that's one of those right there. Okay, and I, I mounted it on top of the um, rosette and just put a little tie up there. And then this is a swimsuit that comes with it, with the set layered up. Isn't that cute? I love it. And there's that tidy little bow. I love that. I can see, I know I'm gonna be using this a lot. <laughs> and it cuts out perfectly too. I mean, it didn't have to fight with it, try to get it out or, you know, have it peel apart or anything. It just, it was, it's really cute. Love that. So there's my beach ball. I didn't make this a mini album. I just made it kind of like a, an embellishment piece. Okay. I did, here's another, just a quick look at, a, at the zigzag pinwheel. That one right there is the small one. This one is the large, yeah. Um, I made another one right here that is the medium. And this one I just put on top of one of those pictures from the Dollar Tree with all these cute little things. And then I just put some glasses up here. So just like a little decoration. So there's those two. Um, I did make, I've only just started on the jellyfish. And so just, I thought I'd just show you. I'm gonna make it an embellishment. I use this, um, this is the, um, I don't remember what it's called, but it's a bow die. It's a bag topper, bow bag topper. And so this is just the part that's not the topper, just like the layering pieces. So, and then I put the little jellyfish up here, but look at how cute those little eyes are and stuff. So cute. And I layered it up, put it up on foam. So these are gonna make really cute embellishments. This is the smaller size, okay? So cute. So like I say, I haven't really finished that, but just thought I'd show you anyway. Okay, and then um, I made my cute little jelly tote. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. So again, sunny days, I use sunny days and all this stuff that I'm making. Um, so I used um, Erica's um, in her basics set. I have the oval. I have the oval and the round, I think. So I used two of those and layered them up for my, you know, just my centerpiece right here. Layered up some cute, this is some old um, ruffled, um, what's it called? It's um, from We Are Memory Keepers. It's the, like for the fuse, you could use this and like fuse it on, but I just use it regular. Uh, popped it up on foam. I got some of the, you know, like thickers and stuff from the collection. This is from the words, the, the summer words. So this is picnic. I cut out in pink, 
I cut it out like three times, layered it up, and then I put it back to it with um, uh, vellum back there. And then for my eyes, I used cute little diamond dots for that. A little flower tuck behind here, some more chipboard. These are the mini, um, the mini heart shaker sunglasses. This is the smaller set. So I did make a shaker, but I just layered up for an embellishment, put a little flower up there. I got some cute little bling pieces just here and there on there. Okay. Um, I did, here is the bigger set of the sunglasses. I just attached a jump ring and, and a little cute little um, bow dango, and I made a cute little pair of sunglasses to hang off my beach bag. Okay. And then I made this cute little, um, my room, there's my room key for my hotel. Okay. So I, this is from Hobby Lobby. We've all been getting, this is, this is from the multicolor pack. Um, they have the different plain colors and they also have this multicolor pack, which is really bright, fun color. So I used one of these for, for this. So, um, so here's the cute little, um, surfboard layered up. Here's another one of the words from the, um, summer word set, surfing, another diamond dot. This one, this little flower is the edge flower that I already had made up. This flower back here is, uh, let's see, I think that's what I cut out from the flip-flops. It was one of the flowers that comes with a flip-flop set. Okay, I just put that behind there just to, you know, just to give it more layers. This right here is the capsule leaf. I just, just a piece I already had cut, so I just stuck it in there. Here's the umbrella that comes with the um, beach ball set and the cute little bow on top there again. Um, the, the, um, the umbrella, I did cut out of um, chipboard also and layered it up on there so it would give it sturdiness since it was hanging off, you know, the side. So I didn't want it to get uh, bent real easy. So I just kind of layered that all up there for my key to hang off my, my um, beach bag. Okay, and then I also made a pocket on the side of mine. So all I did was take the, um, let me show you, hang on. So what I did was take the side piece. So here's the side piece. Okay, so that's what this side is right here. Okay, so then I just cut it out again and I just eyeballed it and just kind of cut it you know, part way off. And I just folded all these edges, these edges and this bottom, I just kind of folded it in and attached it right on top of the other side pieces already there. I just stuck a couple pieces of ephemera down in there. So I just attached it, just folded them in and glued them right on top. And then I put some, you know, a little trim right there. So that makes my cute little pocket. So it could be, you can add, yeah, I could do pockets on both sides and you know, you could add some more to the back and front and whatever you want to do, but oh my gosh, this release is so cute for summer crafting. And you could use this tote, of course, for all year long. This is going to be a must-have dye, this tote. It, it is so cute. So, so cute. So, now I have my beach bag, my beach tote I can fill up. I got my flip-flops. And I got my beach ball. And I got my soda bottle. I got some cute little fun pinwheels. Yeah. And then a cute another cute little pinwheel. I'm gonna stick right here in the side. So cute. And then my cute little jellyfish. He's gonna go inside there too. And yeah, and this holds a lot. Look how much room I still have to put a lot more. So this is going to be so fun for sending swaps. Okay. So I will list everything below. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. Thank you so, so much for watching. Um, I will link Erica's shop. I'll link my discount code to save you 10% at checkout, which is Polka10. It's P-O-L-K-A-10. I have an affiliate link also that I'll um, link down there, and then I'll list all the dyes that I used. Thank you again so much for watching and have fun using these dyes. Bye guys.